would you do if you were elected about Aleppo? About? Aleppo. And what is Aleppo? You're kidding. No. Aleppo is in Syria. It's the, uh, it's the epicenter of the refugee crisis. Okay, got it, got it. Okay. Well, with regard to Syria, um, I do think that it's a mess. I think that the only way we, we, that we deal with Syria uh, is to join hands uh, with Russia to diplomatically bring that at an end. But when we've aligned ourselves with, when we've supported the opposition, uh, the Free Syrian Army, the Free Syrian Army is also uh, coupled with, uh, with the Islamists. Uh, and then the fact that we're also supporting the Kurds, uh, and this is it's just, it's just a mess. And that this is the result of uh, regime change uh, that we end up supporting. And um, inevitably, these regime changes have led to a less safe world. So yeah. an alliance with Russia is the solution to Syria. Do you think Vladimir well, Putin uh, and Russia are a good and, and reliable partner? Well, um, I, th I think diplomatically that that, is the, that that has to be the solution, is joining hands uh, with uh, Russia to bring, to bring this civil war to, to an end. Joe. Um, so Aleppo is the center of a lot of people's concerns across the planet about uh, the, the terrible humanitarian crisis that's unfolding not only in Syria but especially in Aleppo. You asked what is Aleppo. Do you really think that foreign policy is so insignificant that somebody running for president of the United States shouldn't even know what Aleppo is, where Aleppo is, why Aleppo is so important? Well, uh, no, I, I do understand Aleppo, um, and I, I, I understand uh, the crisis that is going on. But when we involve ourselves militarily, when we involve ourselves in these humanitarian issues, uh, we, end up, um, we end up with a situation that in most cases is not better, uh, and in many cases ends up being worse. Uh, and we find ourselves always, uh, politicians are up against the wall um, and ask what to do about these things. And this is why we end up committing military force uh, in areas that, um, like I say, at the end of the day, have an unintended consequence uh, of making things worse. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.